In this video, we're going to be rounding to find an estimated answer. If you're looking for an estimate, then you're going to have to round before you solve. In this example, we're going to be rounding to the hundreds to find the estimate. So 255 plus 653, first we round both numbers to the hundreds. Circle the place value, look to the right, four or less, let it rest, five or more, let it soar. When we're looking at the five, it says five or more, we're going to let this two soar. So two becomes a three, everything to the right is a zero. Our next number, hundreds place, look to the right, four or less, let it rest, five or more, let it soar. We're at five or more, six is gonna soar. Six becomes a seven, everything else to the right turns into zeros. Now I can add my rounded numbers to get my estimate. Zero plus zero, zero plus zero, three plus seven. So 255 plus 653 is about 1,000. Another example here, we're rounding to the tens place to find our estimate. So if we're rounding to the tens, I'm looking at this digit. When we round, we look to the right, four or less, let it rest, five or more, let it soar. Eight is five or more, seven is gonna soar, seven becomes an eight. Everything to the left stays the same, everything to the right becomes a zero. Our next number needs to be rounded to the tens. Look to the right, four or less, let it rest. Five or more, let it soar. Seven is five or more, two is gonna soar. Two turns into a three. Everything to the left stays the same. Everything to the right becomes zeros. Now we can subtract to find our estimate. Zero minus zero is zero. 8 minus 3 equals 5, 4 minus 2 is 2, that means 478 minus 227 is about 250.